Uh, so if you've ever been to a car wash, not uncommon for the attendant to ask if you want a deodorizer for the inside of your car. But the Rainer Sides Gary Harper says you might want to watch exactly where you place that deodorizer. Before you hit the car wash tunnel, you might be handed one of these. It's a small scented piece of cardboard and it's supposed to make the inside of your car smell great. But if you get one of these, make sure you don't put it on your dashboard. This is a Chevy HHR. We do like to keep the car clean. Like many of us, Shy McRae uses her vehicle to run errands and basically get around. And for this Prescott woman, driving around in the high country can get her car pretty dirty. So she tries to keep her car clean. Welcome to our car wash. But on a recent trip to the car wash, something unexpected happened. I bought the least expensive one. It was my first time through. Just prior to entering the wash tunnel, Shy says an attendant handed her a square-shaped air freshener made by a company called Wonder Wafers. So I immediately roll up my window and I hand the uh, air fresheners to my son who's in the passenger seat next to me. And I was like, what do we do with these? He goes, I don't know what we do with them. So he tossed them up on the dashboard. The air fresher stayed on her dash until the next morning when Shy got back into her car. And that's when she realized that this tiny air freshener caused a real big problem. Underneath the Wonder Wafer deodorizer, her dash bubbled up and started peeling. She took this picture when she saw it. Yeah, it was quite a bubble. It was, it was a shocking experience. Upset, Shy contacted the car wash, but was told the dashboard damage wasn't their fault and even told her the Wonder Wafer has a warning indicating do not place wafer on dashboards. Brad Grantham manages the car wash and says he's heard of other consumers complain about the problem. Wonder Wafers, they're definitely designed for under the seat. Um, a lot of people do mistakenly put them on their dash. If you check out Wonder Wafers website, it clearly states that their air fresheners are to be used under the car seat and basically nowhere else. As a first of its kind, under the seat, non-liquid air freshener. Nobody mentioned that we shouldn't put these on the dashboard. And they go, oh, well, it's written right on the, on the wafer. After removing the wafer, Shai says the bubble on her dash did eventually go back down. But as she was showing three in her side where the wafer was initially placed, this happened. Oh, I ripped it. I made it worse. The area was left so soft and sensitive that the dash tore just by touching it. Three your side got a hold of Wonder Wafers International to see if they've heard of similar consumer complaints. They said they have, which is why they print do not place wafer on dashboards. Regardless, the company says they felt bad for what happened and offered to repair Shy's dashboard free of charge. Shy says she appreciates that, but she also wants other consumers to know the consequences of not reading the fine print on everything. The writing is small, and uh, if the people who hand them to you aren't going to tell you, well, hopefully we can. <laughs> Wonder Wafers was really good to work with, and I really appreciate the fact that they're fixing this viewer's dashboard, so thanks. And also, a big thank you to the car wash. They're giving my viewer $60 worth of free car washes, which I thought was pretty nice. I'm Gary Harper, three on your side.